We remodeled this really stunning two-storied apartment for celebrated curator Radhi Shetty, um, founder director of Beiruru and the Purple Turtles. So the brief of this home for us was to mirror his personality, mirror his love and passion for Indian arts and crafts, and at the same time, celebrate the beauty of raw, real, honest materials. The idea was to create a home that was inspired by tropical modernism, while keeping all of the elements fairly simple and balancing them off with very interestingly honest curated artifacts. The bedrooms have been left fairly simple and functional. The guest bedroom has an open layout with a really stunning backdrop behind a rattan headboard. And one of our favorite is the back walls of the guest bedroom, which is hand sketched by a local artist in Bangalore. The master bedroom also has an open layout where we've broken down the balcony um, and increased the floor plan of the entire space. One of our favorite elements in the master are the open green black polished louvered wardrobe shutters. The spine of the entire home is the staircase that ties together both floors really flawlessly. It's a very light, minimal staircase laced by the 12 Chinese horoscopes on the landing. The transition from the ground floor up to the terrace directly transports you to one of the most reminiscent villas of Sri Lanka. Um, it's got a really tropical, lush vibe. A lot of the elements that are in this space are from Radish's very own garden store, Beiruru, and is interspersed with really beautiful pieces and antiques that we've handpicked from the Purple Turtles. You're welcomed into the terrace by two antique, rescued, really stunning doors that hold the unexpected behind them. The whole terrace comes together as a lush green conservatory of sorts that is extremely reminiscent of the cobbled gardens in a villa in Sri Lanka. The bar entirely is made out of granite and shabad and shabad actually is the principal material of the space. It's laid diagonally through the entire flooring and is what continues um, on the bar surface. And the back of the bar is a combination of rescued panels that come together to form this really stunning backdrop. The terrace also has a small cozy powder bath which initially had hot pink tiles in a hot pink tub. We've re-gutted the whole space and simplified every element, every surface in the bathroom. We've also framed very charming art by Nambita Kumar, um, 12 women of Sri Lanka. And as soon as you open the door, that's really the first visual element. We really love that at Studio Roo, all our collaborations with our clients are extremely open and honest. We love to have meaningful conversations about their history, about their beliefs and translate that into our design. And sitting here at the open plan today, I feel like that's come together so beautifully.